Welcome to my channel, my name is Luis Ribeiro and today I'm gonna show you how to put a text behind the subject just like this using DaVinci Resolve. One thing that I always like to start doing is duplicating the file. We want to hold option, drag up, that's gonna go all the way over there. And I'm gonna put the text right here on the second layer because this is gonna be the model, the text is gonna go behind and then this is gonna be the background. So that's what I always keep in consideration. In the effects tab, we're gonna go to the text and for the sake of this video, I'm just gonna use the regular one. I'm gonna put right here in the middle. We're gonna use the top one, go to the color tab. This is all my colors already. I'm gonna go, let's say in the last node, I'm just gonna hold option S. This is gonna create a new node for me. We're gonna go in this magic mask and then you need to make sure that you select the qualifier. Otherwise, you're not gonna be able to see this little plus or minus button. So we're gonna press the plus because that's we will select the area that we want. Then here we have the option of subject or person. Here, if you want to select individual features, you can do that. We have all these different things. Subject do a pretty good job, but for this one, I'm just gonna use person. There we go, we're gonna see this plus sign. And I always like to confirm that this is selected because this was the text and this was the bottom one. If you don't see this, it's the timeline over here. Because I don't know, sometimes you select the bottom one and then you do the effect and you don't see any result. Don't worry, that's the problem. There we go, select the clip. We're gonna go in plus and just help the Vinci Resolve to show what's the area that we're gonna do. But if you wanna see how it is, we're gonna select this toggle mask overlay. And now it's kind of like the Lightroom, but we see here that's not very great, but that is here, quality, faster or better. I usually do better. And you see, boom, get away out of these little corners and stuff. You apply and you need to track back and forward just to save that press here and the video is gonna start just doing his thing and there we go just like that but we don't see anything here what's going on it's because we need to put an alpha output so you click with your right button over here anywhere you want add alpha output and then it's gonna show this blue dot you're gonna bring the blue dot to that one as well and there we go we are able to see our text base already and we can adjust the size or everything that we need and that's pretty much it i hope you enjoyed this video give it a like if you learned something today thank you very much for watching and i'll see you in the next one